welcome to Cheeky Richards, how to make a bacon raft or a bacon mat. Very easy to do, the ingredients are in the recipe box below, so let's get started. We're going to show you how to cook bacon in the shape of a raft. We've got some middle rashes here and we are just going to weave them. So just lay one like so and one like so. Since your old school basket weaving things come into their own, try and have them fairly even. Needs just a bit of adjusting, just slip it through a little bit so that it's nice and tidy. There's your bacon raft. Now we just pop a piece of baking paper on the top of it, press it down. Now you can get a pair of kitchen scissors if you like and just neaten up those edges so it's nice and square. And now with our bacon mat trimmed up, we just sit it onto our sandwich press, pop our top layer of baking paper on it and have it on the press down side so that it actually squashes flat. And that will stop it from wrinkling up. So just cook that until it's nice and crispy and all held together. You'll smell it anyway. Okay, after 10 minutes, this is what you should have. Our bacon raft is nice and crispy and brown. Most of the fat has rendered out of it and we're just going to drain that on some paper towel now and dispose of the baked paper. It's an interesting idea. It looks pretty on your table. You can do it in the oven if you don't have a sandwich press, but it will cool up and make sort of little ripples in it and you'll lose the effect of the actual basket weave pattern. And there you have it, Cheeky Richo's bacon raft. Just take it off the grill now. The grill's still perfectly clean, so you haven't made any mess and fouled your oven. Any dribbles that get on the bench, wipe them up straight away so they don't make even more mess. Because the steam and the fat will escape from our raft a little bit. It doesn't stick to the paper and you have a perfect bacon raft. I hope you enjoyed this little cooking demonstration. If you would like to see more interesting recipes and ideas, just check out our Cheeky Richo channel. And don't forget to please subscribe and do come back and visit us again soon. We have so much more to show you and we're uploading lots of videos every week. Thank you very much for watching. A serving suggestion with our Cheeky Richard bacon rub, chicken sauce and chicken parmesan, and vegetables.